Hello my lovely Sophia here. Welcome back to my channel Sophia Psychic Tarot. So today's daily guidance is for the 20th of June 2021. Now here in the UK it is Father's Day so happy Father's Day to any fathers that are listening out there. So we've got your inner guidance is real and trustworthy and you're on the right path. And eternal love. So three lovely cards there. So please help me hear, see, feel and know the divine guidance that I've asked and prayed for. Allow me to keep my ego out of the way, negative Nancy, so that your wisdom can come streaming through me for my own benefit and for those around me. You're on the right path is Archangel Michael. I call upon you now. Thank you for giving me loud and clear guidance that I easily understand. Thank you for motivating me and filling me with the courage and confidence to make healthful life changes. And we have eternal love. Help me perceive all of the love that surrounds me so that I can feel safe receiving, expressing and giving love. So for your inner guidance is real and trustworthy. They're clarifying it with the magician because remember, you are the powerful creator of your reality. You are the writer and you are the director. The universe, God or whatever you want to believe in, is the producer. So you don't need to figure anything out. You just write what you want or say what you want in your head. Okay, let your negative Nancy get out of the way so that the wisdom can come streaming through you where spirit is then giving you guidance, okay, to take action in the way that you're meant to. You don't need to force action. You're the powerful creator, so believe in your own power. Spirit is saying there. So let's look at the you're on the right path one. So we have the King of Swords and the Empress. So this is a couple. Okay, you're on the right path. If it, some of you are wanting somebody back, then your person is cutting things out of their life, male or female, and wanting to come forward and speak their truths. And you've got to remain in your power as the feminine. Okay, the powerful um, goddess. And eternal love. Let's look at eternal love. Okay, you've got to overcome your negative thoughts. Fight those battles. Swords are thoughts. So fight those battles that you're having within yourself that is getting in the way of the eternal love that you should be feeling regarding a connection that you want. So let's bring in a romance angel for the day. And wedding again. This has been coming out a lot lately. So it's just all about commitments. You know, obviously a committed relationship and then it can go on to marriage if that's what you want. But um, it's just saying that you two or you and a person can be together or even if it's new love. OK, but you've got to follow your inner guidance, letting negative Nancy get out of the way, knowing that you're the writer and director. So you are in full control of the situation because people have no choice but to act the part you're giving them in your movie. You're on the right path if you follow your heart and remain in your self-concept of you are the goddess queen. You are good enough, worthy enough and deserving of everything you want. And opening your heart to love and again overcoming those negative thoughts. So that your person or a person can come forward to you. Okay, and you can end up married or in a loving, committed relationship. I will leave this with you. Love and light.